हॅलो एव्हरी वन माय सेल्फ तुषार गुजराती फ्रॉम एस एन डी कॉलेज ऑफ इंजिनिअरिंग येवला टुडे आय विल स्टडी द एक्सपेरिमेंट नंबर टू ऑफ मेकॅट्रॉनिक सब्जेक्ट अँड द नेम ऑफ एक्सपेरिमेंट इज टू स्टडी आर टी डी अँड थर्मोकपल्स सो हिअर वी आर स्टडिंग कॅरेक्टरिस्टिक्स ऑफ आर टी डी अँड थर्मोकपल्स ओके सो नाव दिस इज द ऑब्जेक्टिव्ह ऑफ एक्सपेरिमेंट एक्सपेरिमेंट ऑब्जेक्टिव्ह इज टू स्टडी द कॅरेक्टरिस्टिक्स ऑफ आर टी डी अँड सेकंड इज टू स्टडी द कॅरेक्टरिस्टिक्स ऑफ जे अँड के टाईप ऑफ थर्मोकपल ओके सो वी आर स्टडिंग हिअर टू कॅरेक्टरिस्टिक्स वन इज फॉर आर टी डी अँड वन इज फॉर थर्मोकपल सो वॉट शुड बी द आउटकम ऑफ एक्सपेरिमेंट आफ्टर लर्निंग दिस स्टुडंट मस्ट बी एबल टू एक्सप्लेन इनपुट आउटपुट कॅरेक्टरिस्टिक्स ऑफ जे अँड के टाईप थर्मोकपल सो देर आर टू टाईप्स ऑफ थर्मोकपल्स अवेलेबल जे अँड के सो स्टुडंट मस्ट बी एबल टू एक्सप्लेन इनपुट आउटपुट कॅरेक्टरिस्टिक्स ऑफ जे अँड के टाईप थर्मोकपल सेकंड आउटकम इज स्टुडंट मस्ट बी एबल टू एक्सप्लेन इनपुट आउटपुट कॅरेक्टरिस्टिक्स ऑफ आर टी डी ऑल्सो अँड लास्ट वन स्टुडंट मस्ट बी एबल टू डिटर्मिन सेन्सिटिव्हिटी ऑफ थर्मोकपल अँड आर टी डी सो थ सेन्सिटिव्हिटी इज ऑल्सो व्हेरी इम्पॉर्टंट कन्सेप्ट सो दीज आर आउटकम ऑफ एक्सपेरिमेंट्स सो बेसिकली यू शूड अंडरस्टँड फर्स्ट ऑफ ऑल वॉट इज थर्मोकपल सो थर्मोकपल इज मेडअप ऑफ टू डिसिमिलर मेटल वायर्स ओके सो दीज डिसिमिलर मेटल वायर्स आर कनेक्टेड टुगेदर सच अ दॅट दे फॉर्म्स टू जंक्शन्स ओके सो वन जंक्शन इज कॉल्ड एज हॉट जंक्शन अँड सेकंड जंक्शन इज कॉल्ड एज कोल्ड जंक्शन सो द हॉट जंक्शन इज नथिंग बट वेअर वी आर गोईंग टू मेजर द रिडिंग सो दॅट हॉट जंक्शन इज कॉल्ड एज मेजरिंग जंक्शन ऑल्सो अँड इट वर्क्स ऑन द प्रिन्सिपल दॅट ॲज द टेम्परेचर डिफरन्स ऑकर्स इन द बोथ द जंक्शन्स द वोल्टेज इज इंड्यूस्ड इन द सर्किट ओके सो हिअर ॲज टेम्परेचर इन्क्रीजेस ॲट हॉट जंक्शन द वोल्टेज इज ऑल्सो इंडि इन्क्रीजेस इन वोल्ट मीटर सो हिअर इन दिस केस टेम्परेचर इज डायरेक्टली प्रोपोर्शनल टू वोल्टेज ओके सो हिअर इनपुट इज टेम्परेचर ओके इनपुट इज टेम्परेचर दॅट इज इनपुट इज टेम्परेचर चेंज दॅन वोल्टेज चेंज इज आउटपुट सो वोल्टेज चेंज इज हिअर आउटपुट सो हिअर द कोल्ड जंक्शन इज केप्ट ॲट युजली झिरो डिग्री सेल्सिअस अँड हॉट जंक्शन इज केप्ट ॲट वेअर वे वॉन्ट टू मेजर द टेम्परेचर सो ॲज टेम्परेचर इन्क्रीजेस वोल्टेज ऑल्सो इन्क्रीजेस सो दिस इज द प्रिन्सिपल ऑफ थर्मोकपल अँड ॲज शोन इन फिगर बिलो थर्मोकपल लुक्स लाईक समथिंग लाईक दिस ॲज शोन इन फिगर बिलो ओके सो नाव वॉट इज आर टी डी वॉट इज फुल फॉर्म ऑफ आर टी डी आर टी डी इज फुल फॉर्म इज रेजिस्टन्स टेम्परेचर डिटेक्टर सो दिस आर टी डी कन्सिस्ट ऑफ प्लॅटिनम रेजिस्टन्स वायर ओके सो दिस इज प्लॅटिनम रेजिस्टन्स वायर विच इज कोटेड विथ प्रोटेक्टिव्ह कवरिंग ओके अँड इज केप्ट इन इन्सुलेटेड सिलेंड्रिकल कोर अँड ओनली टू वायर्स आर टेकन आउट आर टी डी लीड वायर्स वी कॉल इट इज आर टी डी लीड वायर्स फॉर मेजरिंग द रेजिस्टन्स ओके सो नाव वॉट इज प्रिन्सिपल ऑफ दिस आर टी डी द प्रिन्सिपल ऑफ आर टी डी इज ॲज टेम्परेचर इन्क्रीजेस रेजिस्टन्स ऑल्सो इन्क्रीजेस ओके सो हिअर टेम्परेचर इज डायरेक्टली प्रपोर्शनल टू आर ओके सो रेजिस् दिस प्लॅटिनम रेजिस्टन्स वायर हॅज ऑलरेडी सम रेजिस्टन्स लाईक हंड्रेड ओ होम वन ट्वेंटी ओ होम सो दिस रेजिस्टन्स इज फिक्स रेजिस्टन्स बट ॲज टेम्परेचर इन्क्रीजेस दिस रेजिस्टन्स ऑल्सो इन्क्रीजेस दॅट्स वाय टी इज डायरेक्टली प्रपोर्शनल टू आर सो हिअर इनपुट इज टेम्परेचर चेंज ओके टेम्परेचर चेंजेस दॅट इज इनपुट अँड आउटपुट इज चेंज इन रेजिस्टन्स ओके and this resistance is measured between these two wires so this is the rtd now we want to conduct the experiment so what is the procedure so first step is we have to ensure main supply is 230 volt ac plus or minus 50 hertz okay so this is the main supply first of all turn off the fan and furnace so the our setup has fan as well as furnace so that we have to turn off then connect the trainer to mains and turn on the trainer then we have to connect the trainer to mains and turn on the trainer next we have to ensure that digital temperature indicate display room temperature or appropriate temperature that is furnace temperature so there is one temperature indicator is shown so that should show you the room temperature or furnace temperature 
पॉइंट नंबर फाइव इट गिव्स डिजायर्ड सेट पॉइंट ऑन डिजिटल टेम्परेचर कंट्रोलर सो डिजायर्ड सेट पॉइंट ऑन डिजिटल टेम्परेचर कंट्रोलर वी हैव टू सेट पॉइंट नंबर सिक्स इंसर्ट द सेंसर इन द फर्नेस एंड कनेक्ट इट टू द डिजिटल मल्टीमीटर एंड अप्रोप्रिएट रेंज सो नाउ फ्रॉम पॉइंट नंबर सिक्स वी हैव टू इंसर्ट अवर सेंसर इन द फर्नेस ओके नाउ पॉइंट नंबर सेवन टर्न द फर्नेस ऑन एंड नोट सेंसर आउटपुट एज पर ऑब्जर्वेशन टेबल नाउ वी हैव टू टर्न द फर्नेस ऑन ओके and then we have to note the output of the sensor point number 8 if required to restrict furnace temperature switch off the furnace at any point furnace temperature shall latch will go should up around 60 to 800 degrees celsius so what we have to do we have to stop the furnace and we have to take readings okay and then at the end last number point we have to turn on the fan to reduce the furnace temperature so if you want to reduce the furnace temperature to room temperature then we should turn on the fan so like this there is simple procedure is there so in short again i will tell you what we have to do we have to put the sensor in the furnace okay and we have to start the furnace and we have to take the readings for each 10 degree celsius interval okay and after taking all the readings we have to stop the furnace and then we have to So now you can check here temperature is rising 23 degrees Celsius and voltage is also started changing like 0.2 millivolts. Now it is 24, so it will start rising temperature and voltage also. So we have to take readings one by one. so for this setup our input is temperature and output is voltage okay so we can plot characteristics between input and output that is temperature versus voltage and from that characteristics we can find out relationship between input and output also we can find sensitivity of this thermocouple <coughs> now it is 28 Okay, so now this is our second reading. Now for 30 degrees Celsius, we got the output at 0.4 millivolts. So like this, we have to continuously note down the readings for 40, 50, 60, 70, 80, 90 up to 100. Now this is reading for 40 degrees Celsius. That is 0.08. millivolts this is next reading for 50 degree celsius that is 1.2 millivolts one 1.7 millivolts for 60 Okay, this is next reading for seventy degree Celsius. It is two point one millivolts. So like this, we have to continue the reading up to hundred degree Celsius. Okay, so for eighty degree Celsius, reading is two point five millivolts. Okay, so for ninety degree Celsius, three point zero millivolts. Note down final reading for hundred. on the fan okay so like this procedure is there so what are the observation tables here so furnace temperature in degree celsius this is the first column second column is j thermocouple and k thermocouple output so here temperature increases in degree celsius and the thermocouple output is measured in millivolts okay so as temperature increases voltage also increases so we have to take readings in 10 degree celsius means first reading will be taken at 10 degree celsius we have to note down voltages for j type thermocouple and k type thermocouple similarly next reading we have to take for 20 degree celsius 
next 30 degree celsius 40 50 60 up to 100 degree celsius we have to take readings in the interval of 10 degree celsius and we have to note down all the readings for jet thermocouple and k thermocouple in millivolts similarly one more observation table we will require for rtd so same thing is there here first column is furnace temperature in degree celsius but second column here is rtd output in ohm so rtd is resistance temperature de detector its output is in ohm because here as temperature increases resistance increases that's why output is in ohm and after that resistance calculated rc means we can calculate resistance with theoretical formula also and these two readings should be equal rtd output and resistance calculated so same thing we have to do here we have to take readings at 10 degree celsius interval 10 degree celsius 20 30 40 up to 100 and we have to note down all the readings okay so this is the formula for calculation of calculated rc so resistance c is equal to 100 into 1 plus 0 0.00385 t minus t0 so here 0 0.00385 is nothing but temperature coefficient of that particular material that is platinum wire okay so second line for sample reading at t equal to 120 suppose temperature is 120 then suppose r is 125.58 ohm okay so at the time t minus t0 is 120 minus 30 here 30 is taken as room temperature so t minus t0 is 120 minus 30 is equal to 90 therefore rc if we put all the values therefore rc is 111.55 ohm so this is the calculated resistance and same resistance we should get from the experiment also now we have to plot the graphs how you will plot the graph first graph is j type thermocouple characteristics temperature versus voltage okay second graph is k type thermocouple characteristics temperature versus voltage and third one is platinum rtd characteristics temperature versus resistance so here what is written platinum 100 rtd okay so means what rtd is used and rtd having metal wire of platinum and that platinum wire has resistance of 100 ohm okay original resistance is 100 ohm so this is mentioned over here so here in this case the graphs are shown so you check the graphs so now you see the table first of all so there are different types of thermocouple wires are shown e type j type k type r s t so each wire has different combination of metals wires okay so e type thermocouple has chromel and constant turn means positive wire is of chromel and second wire is constant turn second j type now just we have seen j type that we have used so its material is iron versus constant turn so j type wire has material inside in it iron is one wire and constant turn is another wire and k type k type material has wire of chromel versus alumel okay so these are available with us j and k iron constant turn and chromel alumel one is positive one is negative and similarly another type also are available rst r is platinum versus platinum plus 30 percent rhodium us is platinum versus platinum plus 10 percent rhodium and t is copper versus constant turn so like this table is shown over here so we have to plot graph something like this i have shown over here graph so on x axis we have to take temperature in degree celsius and on y axis we have to take millivolts okay we get output in millivolts so here graphs are shown like this j type and k type so they are almost linear one and uh, we should also get such a graphs when we plot on the graph paper so j type and k type are almost linear one out of this k type is very linear j type is little bit non-linear okay so like this you have to plot the graphs so from this experiment what is conclusion from graph it is found that input output characteristics of the thermocouple is linear okay it is linear actually and how will you find sensitivity so sensitivity of thermocouple is sensitivity is equal to change in output voltage divided by change in input temperature okay so change in output voltage divided by temperature is called as sensitivity of thermocouple so this you find from the graph and what is sensitivity of rtd change in resistance divided by change in temperature okay this is the formula for rtd like this you can find sensitivity of rtd so like this 
you can complete the experiment so thank you so much all of you for watching this video in this video we covered the experiment to study the characteristics of rtd and thermocouple thank you so much